Hello everyone, Sons and Duck 2, welcome to another mod for you, this time on Neapolitan. A mod that simply adds in a bunch of blocks related to chocolate and a bunch of other things to do with food involving certain other flavours. And uh, yeah, so there's puddings, cakes, ice cream, and a ton of other stuff. So I'll just go with the blocks first. And survival, of course. So, otherwise we'll go with the recipes, of course, and then get to everything else. So, we've got the... where is it? Chocolate block, which is simply chocolate bars, which is simply cocoa bean, sugar, and a milk bottle. Which you can make like so, and possibly drink. Um, let's see, what else is there for chocolate? Quite a lot. Um, let's see here from there. It is just the block, it seems. Did you maybe need a chisel or something? How do you make the other chocolate bricks? And then from there, maybe even for tiles, walls, slabs, bricks, and a bunch of other things. Let's see. Walls, tile versions, and so on. Okay, so we've got our block, which I think we can just probably break easily. We don't need a pick. We do it. We need to. Besides, obviously, being most of it's storage, decoration as well. So you've got the different ones you can build with, of course. Uh, and obviously, can't forget the tile wall as well. So, yeah. And you get every single chocolate block advancement. Alright. Next, for our blocks, we have the vanilla. Pods, which is simply just that, and dried vanilla pods, which you just smelt. So they're just another block you can build with, I guess, you use for decoration. Which you can also break pretty easily with your fist. I don't think the others you would be able to, or can you? Yeah, so it's pretty much just like breaking a wood one. Um, but yeah, I don't know if you exactly make. Those? I don't think there's much else. Yeah, it is just probably recipes for the most part. It's not like you have to mine it, I don't think. Is that version? Three really baskets of new label quad level. Um Right. I don't think there's any biomes in there, but either way. We'll take a look at what we've got available for the most part here. So we've got strawberries, we've got a bunch of different things we can make with them. We've got pips if you need to for seeds. Um I should for planting, but we'll cover the food first and then we'll see what we can do with planting and everything else. So hunger effect and I am a normal, so we should be fine enough. I'll change the time of day so I won't get attacked by mobs, which I know I will. Okay, so first strawberries, which give us one and a half there, and if you eat anything raw, it'll give you that. I got that with an apple, I think, in a let's play mod pack, so yeah, not too bad. We've got strawberry ice cream, which is two strawberries, some ice, milk bottle, dry vanilla pods if you come across any, and a bowl, which will provide three there and give us, I think, slowness for a bit. Probably maybe equivalent to maybe like a brain freeze or something, I assume is the purpose of that. Um, you've got strawberry cake, which is pretty much a similar recipe to a cake, except strawberries in the middle, milk, and little wheat slots. You just place this down, it gives us pretty much the same as you'd expect for a cake. And you can kind of see the inside, so there we go, so what the inside looks like. We've got scones or scones, I'm not sure. Um, and you've got sugar, wheat, and strawberries there, and you can make two of those. And you get two and a half there. The vanilla pods are only a recipe item. The dried ones are edible though. Just gives you one and a half and gives you a vanilla scent, apparently. No idea if that actually has any certain benefit, or it is just an extra effect, I'm not sure. Now uh, you've got vanilla ice cream, which is just a mix of the following. And will give us three there, some slowness, and also the vanilla scent that we had before. We've got vanilla cake, which we can make simply the same as the strawberry one, except dried vanilla pods are there. And we'll just wait for the vanilla scent to go away, because I assume the cake will also give us that. And upon eating, it does, and 
and we just get one so a bit there. There we go. Something like that is the inside. So we'll go to the effect again and we'll consume the rest as well as see what we have. So next we have vanilla pudding, which is dried vanilla pods, sugar, milk, and a bowl. And upon consuming this, we get three down there and a vanilla scent for a few seconds. We've got the chocolate bar, which obviously we've covered, which is just cocoa beans, milk, and sugar. Just gives you two there, and no chocolate scent or anything else like that. Milk bottle, which obviously you get three of, and I don't think you can convert back to a bucket. Yes, you can. Okay, so there's that, so you can convert back and forth. And that's just going to remove the effect, pretty much just in bottle form though. So if you want stackable milk, I guess that's probably the way to go. You've got Neapolitan ice cream, which is simply made in various ways, it seems. So you can use strawberry, you can use milk, you can use ice, you can use any of the existing ice creams, you've got those, or you can just use vanilla ice cream, chocolate and strawberry like that. So. Depending on how you make it, there's three different methods. So you get slowness, vanilla scent, and sugar rush, as well as quite a bit on the hunger bar there. So quite something. Um, I assume sugar rush is from either too much of chocolate or the strawberry. I know it does show the chocolate there, but either way. Um, so we've got strawberry milkshake, which can also be made many ways with strawberries, vanilla, and a bunch of others, obviously. We drink this, we get one and a half, you get a glass bottle back. You've got vanilla chocolate fingers, which is chocolate bar and vanilla pods. And you'll get three there, and you'll get sugar rush and vanilla scent, which I don't know if sugar rush means you can't eat anymore, or it's just like a an effect that's just giving you for the sake of it. Got white strawberries, chocolate strawberries, I assume white strawberries and not vanilla. And there's no recipe for it, so I'm not sure. So I assume you just find these naturally in the world compared to regular ones, maybe. So you've got two or three and a half there. Chocolate strawberries gives you two there, and sugar rush. You've got the vanilla milkshake, made something like so. You get three of those. We'll obviously give you vanilla scent as well as obviously that there. Okay, no vanilla scent that time. 